hello everyone thank you once again for clicking on this video today i share with you the simple ghana chicken sausage tomato stew recipe with you oh such a delicious one and trust me you are definitely going to love it at the end of this video so if today been your first time on this channel hello this is cocaine with Efia. please do want to subscribe to my channel and be part of this beautiful family let's get started all right so to my heated pot i'll go in with my cooking oil use any cooking oil of your choice moving forward i'll go in with some chopped garlic and ginger i will stir very well and allow it to release its flavors to the oil for about two to three minutes let me also use this opportunity to thank you all my returning subscribers and new foodie members right here you guys are amazing thank you for always liking my video sharing and commenting on my videos fam i am very grateful all right so whilst that is done i'll also go in with my chopped onions and don't worry i'm going to be listing everything i used in the description box for you to check it out and to also add extra taste to the oil i'll go in with my nutmeg and curry powder i have the recipe for the curry powder on this channel i'll leave the video link in the description box for you to check it out so i will stir everything together and allow it to fry for about five minutes on a low medium heat until the onions becomes very translucent after the onions is nice and translucent i will also go in with my chopped fresh tomatoes i will stir very well cover it and allow it to loosen up a little bit and if you are still watching this video and you haven't given this video a thumbs up yet baby what are you waiting for kindly give this video a thumbs up don't forget as well to share this video to reach wider audience thank you so much for doing that all right so after extra five to ten minutes our fresh tomatoes is nice and ready so i'll go in with my tomato paste for the tomatoes you can either use fresh tomatoes or tomato paste it is totally to your preference all right next i'll go in with my powdered pepper or you can as well go in with fresh pepper if that is what you want or you prefer right stir everything together cover it and allow it to cook until oil settles on top beautifully that is when you know your sauce is ready so after about 10 to 15 minutes as you can see the oil is not coming as i want it so i'll give it a good mix cover it again for about 10 to 15 minutes on a low medium heat and allow it to cook until oil settles on top just the way you see it on the screens right now at this point the stew is doing all good and just perfect so i'll give it a good mix and since the tomatoes has really cooked very well i will go in with my protein and for protein of choice i'll be using sausages for this recipe you can as well use any protein of your choice i'll also go in with some smoked mackerel or salmon as we normally call it in ghana so i'll give it a good mix and since i always love my spices to really cook very well i'll also go in with my spices to cook alongside with the protein so i'll be using shrimp cube just one of it is enough for me you can use any amount of your choice next i'll also go in with some fish powder and trust me adding this fish powder to this stew was just a game changer trust me on this one i also go in with some salt to taste always adjust to your taste stir very well and i will cover and allow it to cook until oil settles on top beautifully that is when you know your stew is ready yes so now let's cover and allow it to cook on low medium heat for about 10 to 15 minutes while that is going on don't forget as well that subscribing is free so if you haven't done that yet what are you waiting for please do want to subscribe to my channel also turn on the post notification bell so that anytime i upload a new video you'll be among the first person to be notified thank you so much for doing that
okay so at this point the stew is ready and just delicious so for more crunchiness or extra taste i'll go in with some chopped onions and also some scallions for color and also for flavor as well so i'll give it a good mix and allow the onions to also loosen up a little bit you can allow it to be more crunchy if that is what you want but this time around i want it more soft so i'll cover it on low medium heat for about five minutes and afterwards it should be ready just like this as you can see this still looks delicious and very perfect let me know in the comment section what you're going to pair with this delicious ghana chicken sausage tomato stew recipe i enjoyed mine with yellow rice which i'll be bringing you the recipe very very soon thank you so much for watching this video to this point and if you enjoy to this point that means you are always a proud foodie member do well to subscribe to my channel don't forget as well to give this video a like share this video also to reach wider audience and please do well to turn on the post notification bell as well and be notified anytime i post a new video thank you so much and kindly stay blessed bye